Hello children, how are we? Hello. Now today I'm going to tell you a story about a man who married a mermaid. Did you ever wonder how the O'Sullivans of West Disney came to have the wet fingers and toes? Yeah, tell us. Tell us. Now Shawneen was having no luck with the women. And every dance he went to, he came home empty handed. As usual, he got turned down every time. He was getting old now and he was losing all hope of ever meeting a wife. One fine spring morning, Shawneen went to the shore to secure his boat. Sure, he was as passionate a fisherman as he was a farmer. Look! That must be a copy and director. One, one that my grandfather told me about. And if I take that magical hat, she'll be mine. Ah! Asher, sure don't cry, my decent girl. What's your name? I have lots of acres of land, and pigs, and sheep, and chickens, and cows. I'll make you Mrs. Shawnee O'Sullivan before the whole world if you'd like. Lurking behind the rocks, Shawneen and the mermaid hid quietly to avoid prying eyes. They bided their time in hopes of meeting Father Tom. Good morning, Father Tom. Hello, Shawneen. What can I help you with today? I was wondering if you'd marry me and my chestnut haired girl in here. Oh, Shawneen, how in God's name am I meant to marry you and this. She's not even human. How does two o'clock today sound? Very good, Father. Shawnee and Grania soon settled in to married life. They have three wonderful children that they love with all their hearts. Am I ready for now? I'll be after the fair to sell a few cattle. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. This place is an awful state. I'm cleaning morning, noon and night. Could it be? My copy and Triacta. I haven't seen this in years. I must go back. But what about the children? Mary, mind the others. Why? Where are you going? I don't want to have to mind these blackguards. Just do it, please. Shawneen returned home very tired. Where are my two fine boys? Mary, is your mother home? She went out with some unusual shiny hat in her hand. The copy and director! Eileen! I mean, have you seen Grania? She sure, didn't I see you in this past hour heading down toward the shore? Am I doing the right thing? Will my children be okay without me? The call of the sea is too strong. Every Sunday morning, right before Mass, Shawneen and the children would go down to the shore and collect a golden sovereign. Although they were rich, they were very, very sad. And that was the story of the man who married the mermaid.